Uh, welcome to lesson two of uh, the Intermediate Tim Whistle course. So today we're going to be doing um, ornamentation on the Tim Whistle. So we're going to start off by doing cuts. I'm going to show you um, the cuts do for every note and then we're going to do uh, rolls. So we're going to start off, we'll start off with the D cut. So as you all know, all fingers down for D. So and the D cut, we're going to be cutting with our G finger here. So this finger is going to be the finger that's lifting up for our cut. So I'll just play a D cut for you for an example. So so it's just a quick lift up of the finger. And it just gives you that nice little effect of ornamentation. Then for E, it's the same, same thing again. So you're just playing E. And it's the same finger again. Your G finger, just lifting up. So slow down, re like it plays really slow down. It would be. But you're trying to get that quick, just that quick lift up and down. So. Okay. So we've got our F. Same again, just play F and you're playing that lifting up that finger and this your F finger stays down, that doesn't lift up. Same for E as well, these the two bottom fingers stay down, so you're just lifting your A finger. So for F then it's and again, you know, if you're sl really slow it down, it would be so then. That's your F. Then your G then. You're using the same finger to cut. So. Then we've got our A cut. So it changes slightly because we're changing the finger that we lift to cut. So. lifting our top finger there to cut. So we're playing A and then lifting the top finger to cut. So slow down would be. Then to speed it up then to get the cut, it's. So again, it's just a quick lift of the top finger. Then the last cut then we've got is B. So. And again, we're just lifting the, cutting there with the top finger. So. Okay, so um, so that's the, the cut. So we'll just, just recap that again. We'll just go from the start. So from D, it's. Then we've got E. Then we've got our A. And then we've got our B. So Okay. So it might make much sense to you now just hearing the notes with the cut, but when we go into tunes, we'll be able to incorporate them into the tunes and you'll see then where, where they work. But it's just good exercise just to go up the scale, do a few notes at a time and cut um, cut them. Just do that over a few times and get the, the finger used to that quick lift up and down. Okay, so that's the cuts. So um, best to look with that and we'll see you all in the next lesson where we'll be learning how to do uh, the rolls. So talk to you all then. Thanks very much.